Hi everybody, it's Cindy with Cindy's Creations. Happy Friday or whatever day that you're watching this tutorial. I'm going to be doing some techniques on this bunny here because I know Easter is tomorrow. But we're going to be putting some techniques on him, her and we're going to be using this terracotta. Uh, snow, it's a snowbank, it's a white, and we're going to be using a dauber here, which was a pouncer, we are going to call it, and I already put some in my tray here, so you can see, and we're going to put some on here, and offload it just a little bit, but we're going to do this whole bunny in this, and it gives it a texture, which is pretty cool, um, on here, so we'll get him, her all covered, and it's just a dollar. I don't even remember where I purchased this, but um, we're just going to cover it with, with this um, paint texture. And you can see there is a texture on it, which is pretty cool. <clears throat> and have this ready to be set up in your kitchen or foyer or wherever you want to put it in your home. And we're going to be dressing her up with that. I have some little feet we're going to put on the front of it on her and um, I already have them painted but we're going to be gluing those on the front. I already have my glue tool on which is cool. Hopefully you can see everything. I'm going to make sure of that and if I have too much paint out here in my little palette I'll just put it back into the jar. It's not a big deal for that so but we want to make her white and then we're going to put some pink ears in the middle I think um, for her and I have some ribbon here that we're going to be making a bow. And I have some little <clears throat> pink dots here we can make for her eye. Little uh, crystals, we could do that. There's a lot of things that you could do to dress up your, uh, your bunny. Or you can make it a boy. It's up to you how you want to, to do that. But let's get this all taken care of. And I can get it dry so we can continue. But if you can see what I'm doing. Just putting some texture on here and she's going to be really cute for your home so how is everybody doing today i hope you're having a great day whenever you're watching this and it finds you very happy and um, things are going good for you that's really great right i want to make sure of that i'm just trying to get this done so i can show you it's going to look like she's got fur on her, which is kind of, that's a cool idea, isn't it? So it looks like she's really got fluffy, fluffy bunny. Now, I'm not going to do the size right now because this is just a tutorial, but I'm just going to show you what you can do to make a really cute bunny for your home. Or if you like bunnies all year round, you can leave, leave it out all the time. That's entirely up to you. I think we got it going here. Okay, I did put too much paint out, but that's okay. I can take and uh, put that in, back into the container. I'm going to dry it here with my heat tool so we can get the heat glue on. And then I got some pink paint that we could use to texture paint to put on the feet for the middle of the feet. And I got rhinestones here we can maybe use for the toes, which would be really cute too. So we're going to dress her up and make her really cute for your home. So do you do a lot of crafting for your home? I hope you do. I hope it's something that you'll like to do and come back and see me do some more crafts for you. I'm hoping to do lives pretty soon. So I'm trying to get my um, videos out there so you can see the things that I do. And then you can actually watch me do a, li a live, which is longer, um, so that we can maybe do it together or we can show you if you have any questions while I'm on, you can ask, ask the questions to answer those for you so i'm hoping you're having a blessed day and able to do some crafting it's friday well you can craft any day of the week right that's what i do basically craft almost every day which is cool nice hobby to have especially if you can get things that are cheap cheaper um so it doesn't cost you a lot to make things which is possible have to look around and get some things that you could use or use your imagination and say okay well, I could do something with that and you know purchase it and then take it home and redo it that's what we do for crafting right just about dry here 
Got to make sure she's dry. Okay. And I have some little feet here in the shape of little feet. We're going to be putting those right here on the bottom. So she's going to have some feet like that. Isn't that cute? That's really cute. And then I have some pink uh, terracotta pink color we're going to use for her feet in the middle. Hopefully I can get that on there. And then I have some um, pink rhinestones we could use for the toes, which would be a cute idea, right? Little, give her some bling. That's what we need to do, right? Give her some bling. So I've got little pink ones we could use for the toes. And then I have some pink ribbon here. We're going to make a bow for her hair. Now, whether she has eyes or not, that's up to you if you want to put a face uh, face on the bunny. I'm not going to do that, but if you wanted to, definitely you could do that. So let me shake this up a minute and I can pour some out on this one and we can get her finished up. Now this pink, this pink is not really a bright pink. I don't know if it's going to be the right pink, but we're going to try it. I'm trying to get some out on my little, let me pull it back, uh, on my little uh, paper towel here. It's not wanting to come out very fast. Here we go. We don't need much at all. So we're going to use this terracotta pink. And we're going to, um, maybe I won't use a dauber. Let's see. Let me get a paintbrush. We're just going to use a paintbrush, I think. And we'll get this put on for her ears. Come up here like that and put some ears on her. we got to have pink in the middle, right? Right here. I think this will work. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. What do you think about her having some pink ears in the middle? I think that looks looks good. I think we're doing good with that. Let me get the other one done here real quick. Um, we'll do this a little bit different. We'll have her come down like this. I don't know if it looks like it's flopped over a little bit. So let's just make sure we get this on here a little better on this side just a minute here we'll get this all fixed up the heat tool is all ready to use <clears throat> excuse me water puts it there we go we got some ears done <clears throat> excuse me uh, for that let me get this middle done because they have to have pink in the middle for their feet right their pink, pink toes and pink bottom let me get this painted in here Maybe using the wrong brush, but we'll get this in here. I don't know about those, those, uh, they're really, really bright pink, unless I could put some paint over them. But there we go, the middle of her feet. That's pretty cool. We can do that. I got to get this finished up here real quick because I want this video not to be too long for you. Maybe we could put those on and I can. Put a little bit of paint over them to make them not so bright. So let's get that done. Okay. Get her about on her feet right here. And that'll work. <clears throat> my, <clears throat> excuse me, my heat tool is ready. So put that, <clears throat> put that over there. And we'll get this one put on the other side. Here we go, now stand her up. How cute is that? That is so cute. Cute little bunny. Let me see if I can't get the, <clears throat> these on here for her toes. They are sticky, so let's see if that's not gonna work. I'm not sure. Yeah, I think it's gonna work. We'll just get these toes put on here for her. She's gotta have little pink toes, right? pink toes for our bunny. Three there. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm going to put three over here. And we're going to make a, a bow for her ear. And I think, well, she'll be all done. And ready for you. What do you think about that? You like a little bling on her toes? I think that is so cute. Look at how she stands up there. Let's make a bow real quick and we'll put this in her hair. This is just some 
uh, trim that I have extra and we'll make a little bow for her and we'll get it on her ear. She's going to be all blinged up and ready for her Easter day tomorrow. I think that'll be cool. I'm trying to get this knotted in here. We don't want it to be too big, right? She don't want to be a, too big of a bow, but she's got to have a bow. Okay, I think we're good. Sorry about that. Let me grab my um, scissors here. And we'll get her bow to put on her ear. Let me turn it around a second. Well, let's put it over here on this side. Get some hot glue. And she's got a little bow for her hair. What do you think? I think it looks cute. What a cute little bunny. Thank you so much for watching. I hope I've inspired you to make a bunny or at least do some crafting for your home. Be sure to hit that follow button or the subscribe button and come back and see me again so we can do some more crafting together. Cindy's Creations, have a great day. Bye-bye.